As always, you can find the code in my git repository down in the doobly-doo, and this is just a quick sort. Your array will have to be put into here, and technically we can remove the main method, the static part here, and turn it into a private method, but these are just tiny smidges of visual appeal. They don't change how code works, it's just without a main method, we can't really test whether the, co uh, the code works correctly. Now we just run the program and with this we just get the um, every item in an array. You know, just a generic for loop for an array with items and then you just print the items. This way you can see um, this is the first iteration, this is the second, this is the third and so on and so forth. Quicksort has the idea to choose some well to choose um, an what's it called a pivot element and then just it just compares everything and sorts the things accordingly. So here you just um, get the pivot element five from the array and then you put it in somewhere in the middle and then you just sort everything that's lower than 5 to the left side and then everything that's higher than 5 to the right side. And then you just uh, continue it with the elements. As you can see here, you just um, do it once for the left side and once for the right side. And then this cycle repeats as often as it needs to in order to get to the ending. So. And then again, here is the pseudocode, although I highly doubt you'll need it. This is just the same as I just mentioned. 